Today is Bike to Work Day. It's an annual celebration that um, is nationwide. Uh, the League of American Bicyclists organized. And here in Columbia, we um, try to have rides that come from different parts of the city. And then we meet at the State House at 8.30 for a ride down Main Street to City Hall. Um, and then just kind of uh, part our separate ways. I know it's a hotter day today and um, certainly feels like it, but we're excited it's Bike to Work Day. It's Often we have a, a larger turnout, but it has been a couple years since we've had an organized Bike to Work Day event with folks working from home um, or, or changing their schedules, but um, it feels really nice to be out. I know a lot of the group rides that, that some of the bike clubs and uh, bike shops have been doing have kick, kicked back up and folks are, are getting back into it and it's just a great way to build community and learn what's going on in your community. Um, and kind of make those connections. I mean, it's a huge sustainability piece. It takes, uh, you know, a lot of drivers might be concerned about cyclists on the roads, but we're actually reducing the amount of traffic on the roads. Um, we're able to kind of stagger that rush hour for folks. So it's a, it's a great way to, you know, slow down and learn a little bit more about your community too. You notice a lot more when you're riding. You can kind of pay attention to other um, changes in the city. You might get to see some spring flowers, that sort of thing. You know, everybody rides for a different reason, but the key is that they're out there, they're celebrating, and there are a lot of great ways to do that this May. Even though Bike Month is wrapping up, you do have opportunities to take a virtual ride. Um, you can also, um, and by virtual ride, I mean follow us around the city um, through historic preservation areas um, on a bike. And there are a number of group rides. Like I mentioned, the um, a lot of the bike shops and bike groups around town host those group rides, and those continue on outside of Bike Month. So, Check out our website, it's columbiacompass.org slash celebrate May. And there are some great listings of um, existing rides and a good way for you to plug in if you weren't able to join us today. We actually have a pretty high mode share for pedestrians. You'd think students um, certainly are a big part of that in the downtown. We're about average for, for bicyclists. and But there are some great opportunities that folks may not be aware of from our greenways to um, there are opportunities to ride at Fort Jackson. The fort is kind to provide cycling passes for those who want them. And we have, just in general, we have good weather. So uh, it's 99 today, but um, we, we have a lot of, lot of months of the year where it's, it's a great um, time to ride and it doesn't get too hot, it doesn't get too cold. So um, it's just a good way to get out and around town.